LACME. It's uh, you know almost synonymous with fashion, LACME Fashion Week, and a lot of designers look upon LACME Fashion Week as a great platform to debut and to showcase whatever their new collection is. I've had an opportunity to work for LMW for many, many years, uh, and I'm looking forward to working this year as well. Well, I think it's really important. I think, uh, uh, I think clothes, style, fashion, everything is an incredibly important way of expressing yourself. And, uh, you know, it's great. I, I interacted with some of the young designers and the sort of clothes that they're doing, the sort of styles that they're coming up with, especially for men, which is great, you know, because we men always complain that there's not enough for us, you know, except for the suit and the jeans and the, and the white T-shirts. There's, you know, not so much that you can do. But there's, there's great stuff that's being done and it's, uh, it's wonderful to see. I mean, there's nothing in particular that I plan to do for Independence Day, but, uh, but it's wonderful. I mean, obviously, it's, it's great to live in a country uh, where there is freedom and there's freedom of speech and creativity and the ability to express your thoughts. And it's, uh, it's uh, uh, hopefully that freedom shall be continued and it should not be clamped down on. What is it all about? It's about uh, Lakme Fashion Week and Livia's debut. Livia Reddy is the uh, designer and uh, I'm very, very happy to wear what she's designed. She's debuting at Lakme Fashion Week in Mumbai uh, later in the month. And uh, this is part of, uh, she has a, a very sort of young approach, I think, to fashion. She's got a little bit of a fusion element to it as well because there's a modern silhouette to a traditional outfit, which is, of course, a lehenga. But you can see there's no dupatta. It's got a bit of a trail. It's in a um, lighter than usual color because uh, she's embraced a sort of pastel um, color theme which I like uh, because peach is really one of my favorite colors. And, um, you know, she's here to tell you more about the collection, but I'm very happy to be her muse today. That, it's, I'm, I'm very grateful to have been a part of it for at least four out of those 15 years. Uh, freedom is my ability to be able to express myself in whatever way I want to. Uh, I choose to do it to my clothes, like I'm doing today. And um, on Sundays, I do it, do it through song. Well, freedom, I think it's the freedom of speech, most importantly. So when you have the freedom to give your opinions, when you have the freedom to speak, to feel your, speak your mind, say what you feel, I think that's the most important thing. And of course, at the end of the day, is how you feel um, from inside. So I think it's, it's all about to do that. But I think speech is the most important thing that one needs to have. And that's, a, that's something which I don't think anybody should ever take from anyone. One should always have the freedom of speech and to speak its mind out. Well, um, I think it's always good to have celebration of, of, of fashion and uh, I'm delighted to be here as a muse, my very dear old friend, Ulva Shikor. Uh, we go back a very long way and um, I've always enjoyed her sensibilities of portraying women as empowered, as strong, as individuals who are not afraid to speak out and that's who I am and that's what Ulva Shikor's clothes have made me always be. It is amazing. I think that Lakme Fashion Week is a great platform for new talent and uh, amazing, brilliant talent. Like the one I'm representing today, Swati Vijayvargi. I think that it's in its 15th year, so it's a very good thing. So big congratulations to the whole Lakme Fashion Week team and everyone who puts this show together. And I'm very excited to be here and to be part of this. I think that fashion has to be fun. And that is why I really like Swati's work because I think that there is a, such an element of fun in it. And it's, it's, it's quite rare to find a designer who reflects your personality. Thodi re reflect karta hai. Because, uh, I mean, of course, I mean, there's a lot of talented people out there, but it's really nice to find something where there's a personal connect. So this is what I seem to have found on this particular Fashion Week and I'm really happy for that. Fashion Week is all about drama when it comes to me and now we have this drama. <laughs> this drama has been adorable. Um, this drama has been so forward with, uh, with just accepting to do this for me today. The, this collection is very important because it's, it's an important message that I'm trying to put across to the world. Um, my message is simply, it's simply put as uh, you can love who you want. Uh, it has no boundaries based on whether you're heterosexual or you're homosexual. Um, and that's basically my collection. It's called Be Aware of the Rabbit Hole. You can go th to the other side and be whoever you want to be. So, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I'm very grateful to uh, Christy to actually make me her muse because uh, I saw her collection. I saw her film that she has made for the collection. And I was, 
I was very uh, sort of keen on really like you know being inside the clothes. <laughs> so so I, I said please, I would love to absolutely love to be a part of this. And also the theme, the concept of the film is so close to my heart, and uh, I think close to any human being's heart. So um, so I'm very very grateful. It's great. Uh, in fact, I should congratulate. Uh LFW and it's my first time so I'm really excited and I think she'll be able to say more. Uh, yeah, I've been, uh, I showcased last season as well and so this is the next season of the 15th year anniversary. I'm excited, I'm excited. Yeah.